First on the overnight camera we have Teeny, followed by Chip Chip. And as you can see, Chip Chip was back on two or three occasions in quick succession. There was a very large van parked outside the garden, hence the big shadow that blocks some of the light. Jimmy then came back and so did JJ. Here we have JJ and Tiny. No, we don't. We have JJ and Teeny. And then Ringo turns up. Tiny then comes over. We've not seen her for a little while, but it's always nice to see her. And here we have Teeny and Tiny, or Tiny and Teeny. Here we have Teeny and Chip Chip. She doesn't take any nonsense from these cubs. And then JJ comes over. Tiny comes back. It's always lovely to see her. And Ringo also comes back as well. And here we have a fox that I don't know, but it has got very bad mange. So I just hope that it starts coming back so at least we can get some medication into it. You right down there? Yeah, it was fine. So I just came out the front as I was watching the seagulls and look who's here. Yeah. Yeah. I'm in mean back as well as front now. What are we going to do with you? Huh? What are we going to do? Come on. Look who's back round the back. So today's dinner is roast chicken, roast potatoes, roast carrots and then a mixture of cabbage with um, stringless runner beans and then we have gravy but it has come out very very thick today so I don't like it as thick as that but it is what it is. Yeah, I know you're watching that cat aren't you? Do you want a second one? You didn't want the first one then. You want this one? Sybil. Do you want that one? What are you watching? JJ is first to arrive. Come on then, mate. Let me go backwards. He was just sat out there waiting like he does. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. Yeah, he's early again, and it's certainly turned colder. You've got a cute face there, haven't you? Oh yes, you are a cutie. Don't take you long to go through that, does it? It's okay. You've got a piece of chicken on the end of your nose. <laughs> so we're looking after a dog, but he's going home in the morning. I think he just had a little sneeze. It's okay. Well done, mate. You've left two little pieces of chicken. So Teeny just sneaked up whilst I was sat here, wasn't paying attention. Looked up and there she was, or there he was, because he's a boy, not a girl. So this is another one that looks really, really healthy. Somebody's coming. Teeny came back and I've put a couple of pieces of sandwich out there with some lungworm treatment because I noticed she is breathing quite heavy or he is breathing quite heavy um, and he's just eaten them so I'm well chuffed I've been sat here for probably three quarters of an hour waiting for him to come back nobody else has been since I've left them to the side of the tray but he's eaten them first so at least we know he's had some treatment for worms Well done, mate. So Jimmy has turned up. You haven't got any more scrapes, have you? No. Good. 
and that fur is certainly growing back on his head. Happy days. Yeah, sandwich first and now he's going to the cooked chicken. Chuck out a chicken wing. All right. There we go, there's a couple. Oh, we've cleaned the plate, I won't have to wash it now. Do you want your chicken? Jim? I love the way he goes back to the plate for a second lick. It's all gone, mate. You ate that pretty quick tonight. You did, yes. It's okay. Good boy. So JJ has come back. Just snuck up on me whilst I was sat here. Come here, mate. Do you want this? You ready? Here we go. There we are. Just for you. Good boy. Chip Chip has arrived. I didn't realise she was here as I was in the house doing bits and pieces. But luckily, we've managed to capture her on this bottom camera. I have sped this up a little bit as she was there for quite some time eating, which is always good to see. At least you know they're getting a good meal. JJ then comes back with his back arched. He's being the big I am again, but Chip won't take any nonsense from him. He then goes over to where the camera is. He does cock his leg up the log and he leaves Chip Chip to eat in peace. JJ then leaves the garden and proceeds to sit on the pavement outside. The car then comes and JJ runs off and Chip Chip stays there. Now I'm not sure if it's the dog next door barking, but just watch this bit. I've turned the volume up. It's like she's barking back at the dog. Who knows? But off she goes. JJ is then back again, but doesn't stop for long. And then Jimmy comes over. He grabs a piece of the chicken and off he goes with his piece of chicken. JJ is then back again and he goes over to the water bowl and has a drink which is always nice to see. He then decides to have a wee by the water bowl and then goes over and grabs himself a piece of chicken. JJ is then back again. I love the way they all look up at the door to see if I'm coming out. Here comes Jimmy. Hello mate. Come here, do you want this? Yeah. You want a couple of these? There we go. Good boy. You don't want them. Do you want one of these then? Do you want this? Do you want this instead? Try that. Oh, are you tired? Are you tired, baby? Are you? Yeah. you got a choice there, mate. You are funny, aren't you? What do you want then? Good boy. Bye. Teeny has come back. Hello. 
You alright? Okay, chicken neck and a piece of sandwich. Well done. So tonight we've seen JJ, Teeny, Jimmy and Chip Chip. I know I didn't get out to Chip Chip, but I was doing a few bits in the house. But I'm just grateful that I managed to catch her on the bottom camera so we know she's okay. I'd like to see Ringo. I want to try and gain his trust because his tail's not looking the best at the moment. So I'd like to be able to try and target feed him some mange treatment. I have, however, been putting out some homeopathic mange treatment to hopefully keep mange at bay but I'm not always convinced it works um, and then that poor little fox that came overnight that has got mange I'd like that one to start coming back um, maybe gain a bit of trust with it and then I can target feed and give some proper mange treatment but we'll just have to see what happens with those little guys anyway I'm going to call it an eye I will be keeping an eye out for Ringo and the one with the mange for the next hour or so before I go to bed um, hopefully they come and I can start gaining a bit of trust with them anyway I'm going to call it a night I'd like to thank you all for following me I'd like to thank those that donate as well I really do appreciate it thank you so much and I will see you all tomorrow so from me it is good night